guys, it's Brianna and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's episode of Brie TV, I'm going to be giving you guys five pros and five cons of attending LSU. This is going to be day 12 of my Vlogmas series. So if you guys like the video, make sure you leave a thumbs up, make sure you click the subscribe button and that you also click the notification bell so that you can be notified every time I post a new video. So without further ado, let's just jump right into the video. So just a quick disclaimer and like some background knowledge. I am a junior at LSU. I've been attending LSU for two years. My freshman year, I went to a different school. So I transferred here my sophomore year. And I just want to let you guys know that this video is strictly my opinions based off of my experience at LSU. I am not a spokesperson for LSU. I am not speaking on behalf of the Louisiana State University. This is simply just a Louisiana State University student telling her opinion and her experience to people out there on the internet who are interested in knowing what it is like um, attending LSU. So yeah, I'm not an ambassador, not a representative, none of that. So like, I do not speak for Louisiana State University. I speak for Brianna Brown. So just keep that in mind uh, throughout the video. So without further ado, let's just jump right into the pros and the cons. So I'm gonna start with a pro and then I'm gonna say a con and then just go back and forth until I get to 10. Okay, and also if you see me looking down it's because I'm using my laptop, I have like my notes written up on here. So I'm gonna be referring to this sheet that I wrote down. But pro number one is that LSU has a beautiful campus. Uh, it has great housing options. I personally uh, love like the on-campus like apartments that they have here at LSU. You have like the, uh, you have the campus grocery store. You have the union, which has like a bunch of like places where you can eat in. It's just a very user-friendly campus and I think that it's really beautiful just to look at and just to be around. Um, and like, especially like by Nicholson, like the stadium, like where like the athletic facilities are, it's a very beautiful part of the campus. There's a lot of cute like trees around like the Union and like the east side of campus. The UREC is a great facility. Uh, Mike the Tiger is also like, we have a live tiger on the campus. So you can walk by Mike the Tiger on your way to class and see like a real life tiger, which I don't think any school does that, um, but I could be wrong. So don't quote me on that. Overall, LSU has a beautiful, beautiful campus, especially on a warm sunny day when you're going to class, you're like excited to go to class because whenever you're walking the campus, it's just such a beautiful like sight to see. All right, so con number one about attending LSU is that scheduling classes is literally like worse than the Hunger Games. Like prior to coming to LSU, I used to be a student athlete at a different school and we had advisors schedule classes for us. So when I came to LSU, I had to schedule my own classes and it's literally the Hunger Games. There's literally so many students that attend this school. Luckily, I'm in the honors college. So like if you're like an athlete or like you're an honor student or if you have any other like credentials, I guess, you have like priority scheduling. But if you have to like schedule your classes with like just like the rest of the student population, like it is hell because the classes are full by the time that you want to pick them. The good professors are full by the time you want to pick them. The times that you want, it's just a pain in the butt trying to schedule a class. That's definitely like one of the biggest cons about attending LSU. So pro number two about attending LSU is that there are endless opportunities at this university. LSU is such a big school with so many different programs for you to like join. So whatever you are interested in, you truly can find some way to apply that to your experience at LSU. For example, if you're into fashion, you can join the LSU fashion committee because they have fashion shows and stuff like that. If you're into science, you can take you can take science classes and I'm sure there's like a science committee or a science like club or you know, that kind of stuff. You can you can definitely get into whatever you are interested in. LSU definitely has those resources available for you to take advantage of. So the second con about attending LSU is that it's a big culture shock and adjustment for students who are out of state. And this is me speaking off of my personal experience. I'm from Texas, so I'm literally from a neighboring state. But when I started going to school in Louisiana, it was a huge culture shock. The food, the music, and even the way people talk are just so much different than where I'm from. So when I came here, I was like, dang, like I kind of felt really out of place. For example, I feel like a very popular slang word here that people use is Joe's. A lot of people in Louisiana are like, they say the word Joe's. And when I came here, I was like, what does that mean? The, the word Joe's honestly has so many, like it has so many like different connotations that it can be used like interchangeably in different ways. Like 
oh yeah, I'm joasting so-and-so or yeah, we were just at the union and we were just joasting. Like we were just talking, chilling, etc. Or you can say, yeah, that's my joast. Like that's like my, my boo. But people also use the word trade here, which is like a New Orleans thing where they're like, yeah, that's my trade, which is like your boyfriend, girlfriend. Another word that a lot of people use, especially when they would like send me DMs on Instagram would be like, was am or like what's happening. They would say was am like W-A-Z-Z-A-M. And I'm like, what does that mean? I mean, it means like, what's up, what's happening? But like people are like, was am? And I'm like, ew, it's just not cute. Um, and what's like another word that a lot of people use at LSU? Uh, buku, which means like a lot, like there's buku people here. Those are like the main ones that really caught me off guard whenever I first got here. I was like, what are these people saying? Cause I've never heard these words before. All right, so moving into pro number three. I think a big pro about attending LSU is the school spirit that they have at this university. If you, obviously, if you like live in America and stuff, you know, like you've heard of LSU, you know LSU is like a big sports school. So like going to football games, basketball games, gymnastics, track meets, baseball games, etc. Like every sporting event here is so much fun because there's so much school spirit. And I feel like most people that attend LSU like wanted to be here or wanted to go here. There's like some universities, like I, especially I remember when I went to Tech, like a lot of people didn't really want to go there, you know? They were just there because it was like the best situation for them. I feel like a lot of people here like genuinely want to be here and they enjoy their time here. So it shows with their school spirit because they're proud to be like an LSU student, an athlete, tiger, whatever you want to call it. So con number three of attending LSU is that it's in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Um, and this is just my personal opinion. I think Baton Rouge has some very nice areas and they have good sushi, okay? And they have good seafood places to eat at too, which is my two like favorite things in the world. However, th there are some like dangerous areas that are like right next to the campus. So if you go on, if you go down like Highland, like it's real sketchy and there's a lot of potholes and just a lot of bad infrastructure. Um, but that's honestly anywhere you go. I feel like no matter where you go to school, there's always gonna be like some bad infrastructure, some damaged roads and some like, there's gonna be like a dangerous area. So you really have to be on your P's and Q's whenever you're going out because people have guns, knives, pepper spray. I don't know. People have weapons here, okay? So you gotta be on your P's and Q's whenever you're going out. You have to know where your exits are whenever you're entering a building, party, whatever, because you wanna know how to get out of the situation if you have to start running for your life. But yeah, LSU is in Baton Rouge, kind of a very, like I said in my last video with my friend Carlo, a very rough area. So I'm sure a lot of other universities are in or are located in rough areas. So you just have to take it upon yourself to be conscious of where you are, who you're with, what you're around, and just know the scene that you're in so that you can be safe. Pro number four is that LSU's campus is very user friendly. And I kind of touched on this in, tip, in pro number one, but like, yeah, it's a, it's a walking campus. I mean, if you don't have a car, you can like, during the day, you can walk around like the campus and feel safe. And there's a lot of like crosswalks, sidewalks, and like beautiful scenery, scenery when you're walking. Um, but yeah, I, I feel like the longest to go from like the opposite sides of campus is like 30, 35 minutes, which is very long which is why I'd be driving through the campus, but like it's a very walkable campus. Uh, they have the gym, they have the the UPS office, they have great weather sometimes. I mean, we're gonna get into that in the next con, but most days it is good weather, it's warm, it's very user-friendly. And they also have like campus transit for students who like, um, like have like a very long like walk to class or just don't have a car or something. You're able to like call Tiger Trails or campus transit and they'll come and like, go to like little bus stop and like pick you up and then like drive you to like whatever destination that you need to go to. So I think that LSU is a very user-friendly campus. Uh, there's like a bunch of places you can eat at on campus. And they also have like two like infirmaries, like they have like the urgent care, like by Nicholson. And they also have like the student health center where you can get tested for like COVID. You can get STD tests, COVID tests, like any kind of test. You can get checked out by doctors if you're feeling sick. Like it's just a very user-friendly campus. And I think it's very, resourceful for students that go here. Con number four about attending LSU is from, in my opinion, and also based off of my experience here, LSU is kind of a segregated university. You'll kind of notice that when you like come to campus, it's very diverse. There's a lot of black, white, Asian, Hispanic people that go here. 
However, you notice a lot of people stick to themselves. So a lot of black students will hang out with black students, white students will hang out with white students, etc. I feel like that's kind of natural and it's kind of like human nature to kind of want to stick and gravitate towards people who kind of identify with you. But I feel like it's very present at LSU. Um, and I don't think it's like, I don't think it's purposeful. However, it, it is something that I've noticed um, while attending LSU. I wouldn't say that it's made my LSU experience negative because you can definitely talk and become friends with people of all kinds of races, ethnicities, nationalities, backgrounds, etc. cetera. Um, but I will say that it's very like, you'll feel it when you come onto the campus, you'll see like a lot of like separation amongst people. And my last pro for attending LSU is that the nightlife like parties are pretty fun. I would say Tigerland's very fun to go to. Um, and then Oasis used to be fun, which is like a bar like down Burbank, but it's not the same. It's not how it used to be. It's very dangerous now, so I don't go there anymore. Um, the apartment parties can be fun, but also very dangerous. So really just Tigerland's like the main thing. But typically like if, you, if you're in like an organization, if you're in a club, sorority, or just a part of something or you know people, like there's always like stuff happening like on campus during the day, on the weekend. Like I feel like there's always something to get into. Like I said, it's big on school spirits. Like going to like the basketball, football, gymnastics, track, like baseball games, going to all types of sporting events. Like between sporting events, class, and like social things that you can do and like parties and stuff, like there's always something that you can find to do. So like you're never really bored. And then last but not least, uh, my fifth, con about attending LSU is that teachers and advisors um kind of really care and like yeah we're, everyone that is in college like you are an adult you're supposed to take care of yourself you really have to be self-sufficient and disciplined um if you're attending LSU because there's distractions everywhere so it's easy to get caught up but back to like my point about teachers and advisors sometimes advisors can give you the wrong like information so you really have to fact check them so, or you have to do your own research to make sure that you're being told the right information. And then depending on your professor, I'm not saying all teachers, I've had some great teachers and professors and advisors here at LSU, but there's also some like bad ones too that really do not care about like your success. So you really just have to be smart and be proactive whenever you're like scheduling your classes and make sure that you're using like rate my professor and talking to people that have taken those classes before so that they can recommend you some like good professors to take. Um, but that's probably also like something that's common at like literally every university. No human is perfect, no university is perfect, and no like class is gonna be perfect. And neither is any college, but those are just my top five pros and cons of attending LSU. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I hope that these tips helped for anybody who is interested in attending LSU. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.